Are you sick and tired of watching your golf ball curve into the woods? Have you had enough of your Bozo golf partners telling you to keep your head down? Would you like to add another 20 yards to your drives? For years, I faced the same struggles as you are now, always getting golf advice from my friends, but never improving. Play the ball off your front foot. Slow down, they would always tell me, but I just wasn't getting any better. Fortunately, I took a job in the golf business. At this point, I was able to work with some of America's top golf instructors, and I realized that they were not telling me any of the advice my friends had told me. In fact, oftentimes, they were telling me the exact opposite. Before long, I was teaching golf as a member of the PGA of America. The clients I worked with would almost always tell me that they knew what their problems were. And time after time, they would tell me some of the same things my friends had told me when I struggled with golf. So I started to use high-speed video software and 3D wireless technology to research what was really happening in my client's golf swings. What I found will blow the lid off of all the common golf advice that is floating around the links. As a result, I have made it my mission to save every golfer on planet Earth from miserable golf. So enjoy all the great information and action steps I have put together for you, and I look forward to working with you. Yeah, you're doing a lot better in your backswing to the okay. point where you're more level, yeah. and you're still dropping down as much as you were before yeah. when you were up tall in your backswing. Okay. My name is Barry McKee, and I've I played golf uh, most of my life off and on, not a whole lot. I've had lessons here or there, and uh, this year I started with Scott. And I have to admit, since I started working with Scott, he's added about uh, 10 to 15 yards on my iron shots. My uh, wedge used to be a steady 100 yards, it is now 115. And that's quite confusing, because now I have to make up different shots at the 100 yard mark. And my uh, 150 yard was always kind of a, either a weak six iron or a strong, strong seven, and now it's just a nice solid eight. And again, I'm 150 yards, I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna do from now on. So it is nice to hit the ball. 10 yards longer on all my irons and clean and crisp. Scott's been a, a, a real a great teacher to talk to. He's, uh, he, he takes interest in me, takes interest in my game, uh, sends me emails. Uh, he's understanding, he listens. Uh, other instructors I've had had their program where you sit down, you're going to do it their way. Scott listens to me and uh, figures out what's going to work out best for me and it's uh, a great guy to work with. I still want to reinforce with you, we did some shots off your left leg only so that your balance was into your left leg. Okay, yeah. Your weight's already up there. That's one of the things, you still hang back a little too much on your right side. Mm -hmm. So to strengthen and coordinate your left side so that it can handle the balance and the weight transfer better, you can hit little pitch shots off your left leg only. I've been working with Scott for about two years now and uh, it's been an interesting experience. It's been a good experience. He's uh, taken a lot of concepts I had about golf, and I've golfed for a long time, but without a lot of instruction. And he's uh, given me uh, more insight as to what uh, golf magazines say. I used to misinterpret their instructions. So he's taken my swing and broken it down in the fine pieces of a swing and helped me rebuild it from scratch. And it's a, it's a long process, it doesn't happen in a year, and I'm in my second year, but I can say my game is a lot more fun. Uh, practice with a little more understanding of the game. I see these improvements in uh, some of the subtler areas of my swing that I simply was not aware of and uh, couldn't have understood without uh, proper instruction. The thing I appreciate about Scott the most is that um, he's easy to talk to. Uh, some of my questions I feel I should have known better, they seem kind of silly, but he takes them seriously and actually uh, there is actually something to my questions that makes sense, at least they make sense to me, and he puts it in a way that I can understand it. So I look forward to continuing my experience and my journey, and I'm looking forward to that my scores are going to eventually get a lot lower. Yeah, hold the shoulders back a little farther. There you go. Good. Um, after the first lesson with Scott using the KVEST technology, he quickly pointed out what I was doing wrong, which was just about everything. He straightened my posture. He improved my swing, which was pretty much like a corkscrew coming down. With the KVEST technology, you hear an audible, you see your, your, see your swing compared to that of a pro, and uh, what you quickly realize is just how wrong you can be. There's no substitute for seeing it um, instead of just feeling it or trying to think it through. When you see it, uh, you believe it. And um, my game has improved. I actually have an eagle. 
uh, which a lot of people were more excited about that than I was because I was stunned. Um, scores have come down, putting's better, and um, looking forward to getting out there and, and wowing the, uh, my neighbors who we play with on a regular basis. I actually took up the game late in life. I took up the game in 95 and uh, lived in California. Took a lot of lessons with different people. Some were hands-on, some weren't. Uh, the thing I like about Scott is he, he talks to you, he, he brings your club back, he puts you in the right position, he guides you through every step of the process. He's, he's easygoing, he's uh, conscientious, you know he's a great guy, you can just tell he's a straight up kind of guy. And uh, he doesn't, uh, unlike some other teachers I've had, he doesn't think there's only one way to get the job done. Uh, he knows as long as you can bring the uh, club square to the, to the ball, you're going to get it down there and you're going to get it down there straight. And that's, that's really important. Some teachers, it's their way or, the, or, or no way. What is the expression? It's my way or the highway. Scott's not like that at all. He's, he's, he's a terrific teacher.